Hey guys, Mike here with Off Leash Canine Training. I've got Milo. Uh, Milo is a rescue. He's a husky. He came in with his friend Bam Bam, who you can hear making some noise because Bam Bam doesn't like to be left alone. Um, Milo comes to us because, same thing, he has some separation anxiety issues. Uh, he has some guarding issues when it comes to the other dog that lives in his house and taking the toys and hiding them. He digs holes in the yard. Uh, and really just his obedience is kind of non-existent. Uh, he really just does not listen to his owner when there are any sort of distractions around, so we're going to work on fixing that. So I'm going to take a second, show you what Milo knows now. That way you can see how much he's improved. Milo, come. Milo, come. like Bam Bam, understand some of his commands, so we'll just work, work on making them more consistent and working around distractions. So stay tuned for his progress in two weeks. That's a good boy.
excited. Good boy. Praise, praise, praise. My name is Paula. This is my dog Milo, who's a rescue husky. Um, when I first rescued him, he was completely untrained and he slowly started to dominate the house in every manner possible. He was destructive. He was not crate trained. He slept on the beds. He slept on the sofa. And when we were gone, he ate shoes. He ate cushions. He destroyed crates. He went through two or three duvets. And then I, a friend of mine gave me Mike's information and number, and I desperately called Mike up. And he's been here for how long? About two, three weeks? Uh, he's been, well, he's been here well, for... He's been here Six weeks. He's been training for two weeks. Milo's been here for about six weeks, and Mike has been training him for a good two consistent weeks. Um, in the two hours I've been here, the changes have been just unbelievably noticeable. Milo heals off and on lead, which he didn't do before. Milo used to pull. Um, Milo places. Milo goes down upon command. Um, Milo has door manners. He goes in and out of the house um, when he's told versus when he wants to go in and out of the house. I hear he's completely crate trained after Mike put him through how many crates? Two or three, three. different crates three. That he managed <laughs> to break out of. So I am really, really excited about bringing home a really well-trained dog the only problem is now is that now I need to be trained <laughs> <laughs> because I found the training process to be really daunting and I can't thank Mike enough for all the working time he's put into my life. You're welcome. And if we need help, Mike, I'll be calling you. Always. And I'm really looking forward to taking him back to the city and having a dog that is really, really trained.